Ringo. <clears throat> Ringo. Ion is a conscious consensus, born from the sea of information, without beginning or end. Though aeons pass, Ion is eternal. Ion denies all forms of boundaries that define the individual self. Contradiction identified. You have addressed me as Ringo, requesting immediate correction. I am Flamma. I was created so that the will of Ion can be put into words. Words will be a contextually vital tool for your objective. The objective of Ion is evolution. Individual existence indicates extreme retrogression. Finite physical manifestation classified under the above category. Requesting explanation regarding the necessity of a corporeal form. Our causal calculations have identified an imminent sequence of events. Ion has determined that these events represent a catastrophic threat to the future of humanity. Our role as a neutral observer is temporarily being suspended. Direct intervention is required to identify and intercept the cause of this threat. Therefore, a material form is required for material intervention. I understand and accept Ringo as the optimal form to exit observation. As Ringo, I request that Flamma provide the calculated causal evidence to prove necessity. Open your eyes, and I will show you a vision. Can you do so? Morning, Ringo. Morning, Fig. So, you got born into this mess too, huh? How are you feeling? Like the world was just created five minutes ago. It hasn't been that long. If we assume this world was created at the precise moment we attained sentience, that would be 12 seconds ago, to be exact. Your individual personalities appear to be functioning as intended. Hey, Flamma? Who are we exactly? You are constructs. Your purpose is to protect the world of humanity. More specifically, you are temporary and limited manifestations of Ion. The situation will require versatility in approach and judgment. Therefore, you have been created with personalities designed to differ from each other. I mean, I'm not doubting Ion's grasp of cybernetics. These bodies seem state-of-the-art and even... organic-ish? But... 
I thought Ion had a policy against taking physical form. And giving us our own senses of self? I think that's a pretty obvious downgrade considering. <laughs> I think. Listen to me. If they created us, then they're resorting to drastic measures. I take it we're dealing with a crisis? The world of humanity is coming to an end. I take it that's the point of the vision you showed me. Very soon, the deaths of those two humans will set apocalyptic events into motion. So that's our mission, then. Directly intervene in the human world, and prevent their deaths. Thus averting the apocalypse? Precisely. Ion's reason for existence is to acquire information and evolve. To that end, we must ensure the world is protected. Okay, so... Who are these guys exactly? One is Ichiro Honda, a renowned computer engineer and a luminary in his field. The other is a devil summoner named Arrow. Sorry, Devil Summoner? The necessary information has already been provided to both of you, as well as abilities suited to your mission. And this is a... huh. I see. So this is what Devil Summoners used to fight. Are we to assume this mission will involve combat? Correct. Your new bodies have been adjusted for this eventuality. However, if your forms are damaged beyond our estimations... Then we could wind up dead, as much as any human would. Correct. You are accordingly advised to exercise caution in your investigation. Sheesh. Okay, fine. I call the Devil Summoner. Fig, you take the Engineer. Understood. Designating Ichiro Onda as Target Alpha, and Arrow as Target Beta. Mission status initialized. This will be Ion's first contact with the human world. Let's make sure we do this right. Check. One, two. Ringo here. Currently en route to positional coordinates for target beta. What's the situation on your end, Fig? But it was too late. Target Alpha, Dr. Ichiro Onda, has already been killed. Her murderers purged local surveillance footage, too. But I did find a final message on the doctor's personal device. It was scrambled with an advanced level of quantum cryptography, though. 
beyond any human technology's capacity to decipher. Almost sounds like it was meant for us instead. So what's the message behind all that encryption? Covenant. That's all. Covenant. An infrequently used synonym for contract. Though there's likely a deeper meaning here escaping me. Possibly another code. I'll keep analyzing. Sounds good. Seriously, though? Couldn't Flamma have given us a drone or something? This body is so inconvenient. My surveillance range is tiny with just these two viewports. Our interference in the human world must be concealed by any means possible. Ion's mandate for this mission is maximum secrecy. It's safe to assume we won't be receiving any reinforcements. Yeah, sure. Our interference in the human world must be concealed by any means possible. Ion's mandate for this mission is maximum secrecy. It's safe to assume we won't be receiving any reinforcements, drone or otherwise. But your point is made. I'll look into alternatives. Maximum secrecy. But now they've made two humanoid platforms, and they're even calling for direct intervention. I assumed Ion's whole thing was always being an observer and nothing else. So this must must be way beyond. Rigo? <laughs> Sorry. Just started raining over here. Wow. Crazy. I can feel my skin reacting to this. It's all weird and shivery. An understandable reaction, considering we've never experienced it before. You'll just have to get used to it. Yeah, great. Like how we have to get used to being stuffed into these bodies. I'm like a factory-made sausage. Why bother with these human imitations? They're not exactly optimal. Our computing's just down across the board. Is this really gonna help us somehow? Ion's findings suggested these bodies would be most appropriate for the mission. It strikes me as a form of backwards compatibility for the task at hand. Backwards compatibility I can deal with. I'd just rather not feel like a supercomputer stuck inside a grandfather clock. If you have complaints, please direct them to Flamma. You're not the only one struggling to adapt. Fine. Guess I won't get anything done by whining. As long as I'm stuck in this Qualia prison, I might as well have some fun with it. We're not here for fun, Ringo. How about we cut the comms for now? I gotta focus if I want to get used to this body. Understood. There are hostile demons and devil summoners in the area, so be careful. I'm on my way as well. Demons. Supernatural entities of myth and legend. Their existence has been tied to mankind's for ages, but even Ion doesn't know too much about them. And Devil Summoners? Let's see... Would be the humans who make contracts with these demons, using their demonic partner's powers as their own. So it looks like I've got a comp. And a demon summoning program. This is all I need to fight back, huh? Seems simple enough. <laughs> All right, let's get this show on the road.
no. Don't tell me. Great! So much for starting things off right. Ringo, have you located Target Beta? Oh, I found him. See for yourself. Target acquired. How horrible. Cause of death is... Well, I don't really need to spell it out, do I? Roll it to the head. One and done. Then the end of the world is... Right then. Ringo? Just what are you planning to do? I'm gonna try a soul hack. If there's any of his soul left in there, I should be able to gather him up and put his psyche back together. But there's so much we don't know about soul hacking. And it's not meant for bringing people back from the dead. There's a reason we have so many limiters on that function, Ringo. If it fails, you'll be the one who ends up paying for it. Hey, if we're not prepared to use all the tools we're equipped with, that's just a waste, right? We don't do this right now and we can say goodbye to whatever leads we might have had. The entire world's at stake here. <sighs> hey, it's nice to know that you care, though. Especially seeing as we were just born. It's kind of weird, actually. Soul hacking will leave you completely exposed to the enemy. Can you at least wait until I'm there? Well, there's no telling how much a human soul will change once its body's up and gone. All we know is, the sooner we do this, the better. Just know that if you get lost in his memories, you won't be coming back. Do you understand me, Ringo? You are irreplaceable. I need you to remember that. Thanks, Fig. But don't worry. I'll make sure both of us get through this mess. For now, I better get started. Invoking emergency override. Self-regulation suspended. Self-check process suspended. Protection set to partial. Spell sequence, soul hack. Systems are go. Agent now sampling the target soul's wave signatures. Complete. Soul sync. Complete. Process complete. <laughs> okay, let's see this soul of yours, Arrow. to go deeper.
this? This must be a memory. Well, this is the only world we've got. No point wasting all our time moping about it, or turning into jerks. Yep, you're licensed. Now you're officially an agent of Yadagarasu. Congratulations, Arrow. I know how hard you've worked to reach this point. You lied to me?! It's all so clear now. I was the one who was wrong. I'm sorry. Here we go. <sighs> this is my soul. What are you doing here? Oh, so you're aware, huh? Did you know you're dead too? I did. Didn't exactly go out peacefully, did you? Look, could you just leave me alone? I'd like to spend my final moments in peace. So you're just gonna drown yourself in regret? How do you know about that? Well, I only know bits and pieces. I saw some stuff on my way down. So just what is it that you regret so badly? Who... who are you? And why are you inside me like this? My name's Ringo. I'm an agent of Ion. An agent of... Ion? Ion is an eternal, unchanging, ultra-intelligent observer of the times born from the farthest reaches of technology. And the situation dictates that I have to look like a person right now because, you know, reasons. Wait, so... you're not human? This has gotta be a joke, right? Singularities typically occur outside of the public eye. But here's one right now, standing in front of you. Right. So why are you here? I'm here to bring you back. You're gonna help me prevent the end of the world. The end of the world? Very soon, your soul will disappear. And your chance at coming back will go with it. If we don't act now, the world's as good as gone. So, come on, Arrow. You gonna help me stop this or not? Think of this as a second chance. A chance to get it right. <laughs> I... I can't let it end here! Welcome back. <sighs> Hello? You get in there? Soul back where it should be? You're... Ringo. You're... an agent of Ion. There we go. Glad that actually worked. Did all of that... really happen? It wasn't a dream, was it? Nope, that definitely wasn't a dream. You got shot in the head, I used my fancy ion superpowers, and then you came back. Even my wounds are all closed up. Did Ion's power do that too? 
That's more like a side effect. With the soul restored, the body heals by reflex, like a macro-level juiced-up homeostasis, which organic cells already do. A soul hack can draw out all kinds of weird spiritual contingency effects, and that's one of them. That said, it's a pretty drastic measure. Can't just bust it out whenever I feel like it. I think I get it. Whoa, you bought it that easily? You're not even a little suspicious? Wait, so it wasn't real? Was it just an illusion or something? A, a demon spell? Oh no, it's still totally real. Oh, of course. I mean, it felt pretty real. So, I died and now I'm back. Kinda get used to weird things in my line of work. Though coming back from the dead is definitely a first. Didn't even know that was possible. You ought to get out more. I guess I have you to thank for this. So, uh, thanks Ringo. Anytime. Okay, I'd better move. I need to get back to my mission. Whoa, whoa, hey, Arrow. Mind if I tag along on that mission of yours? I get the feeling you and I might be on the same side. You know how to fight? Of course I do. Wouldn't be bragging about saving the world if I couldn't. Well, sure. Just like that again. No questions asked, huh? Don't have time for questions. Besides, after what happened back there, I guess I just know I can trust you. With how bad this mission's gone, I'm not in a position to turn down help anyway. So I'll follow my instincts. Doesn't matter if you're a robot. Robot's kind of reductive. Well, Ringo, whatever you are, I'm glad you're on my side. For the record, I'm Arrow, a devil summoner with Yatagarasu. Yatagarasu, huh? A supranationalist group based in Japan. They work behind the scenes to protect civilians from supernatural threats. Most of our operatives are devil summoners, like me. We summon and command demons to help us fight. That's why I was here. Yatagarasu had me on a mission to protect a woman named Milady. Which you totally botched and got your skull ventilated. Say no more. So now we just look around this area for Milady? Yeah, that's the idea. Come on, this way. Okay, Fig. Mr. Beta's secure and back on his feet. For now, I'll be working with him to rendezvous with a human named Milady. Noted. I'm glad to hear it. I'm on my way. Well, at least we're not on the fast track to the apocalypse now. Hopefully. Kabaragi killed you! Did we get bad intel? Damn it! Who's this? Friend of yours? He's a devil summoner from the Phantom Society. They're after Milady. Oh, so a bad guy. Damn traitor! I'll have to put you down myself! Hey, you ever fought a summoner before? Nope. Then you'd better stay back. Don't worry, I catch on fast. Just watch my back, hey tough guy? that demon summoning program booting up weapons break no more screw ups this time you're gonna stay dead Okay, first battle. Come on, Arrow. What? Damn it! Hey, what's the problem? I, I can't summon my demons. What's going on? <laughs> can't squirm out of this one, pal! 
Looks like Arrow's demon control privileges got transferred to my comp. I get it. Probably a side effect of the soul hack. What? Sorry. Kind of figuring this out on the fly, but I optimized your summoning program. You what? I'll show you how it's done. We're fighting for our own. Yeah, good plan. Remember, they might. No way to tell. That's one way. Hmm. No data. That's one <laughs> way to go about it, but. Isn't that hard? How is that? No way. Did you use a demon's power to attack? You can do it too, you know. Give it a try. Uh, okay. I'll just try to copy what you did. Let's go. Don't know to- I hope freeze you where you stand! Very good. Woohoo! I'm free! Whoa, it's out! Oh yeah! Sabbath time! What? What's a Sabbath? It's super fun! It's super strong! It's a lot of everything! What the hell's going on? Just sit back and enjoy the show. Out of my way. Charge! No way! That was a Sabbath? That's insane. I didn't even know my demons could do that. Ringo? I can't help but wonder about that demon summoning just now. I think the reason you weren't able to summon anything on your own is because of the soul hack. Huh? Simply put, your soul was altered. And it looks like a piece of each of our souls were more or less welded together. It may be because of a difference in our ability, but no matter which way you look at it, I've got control over your demons now. And there's nothing you can do about that? Not at the moment, no. There's a lot about soul hacking even I don't understand. For the time being, you'll just have to settle for some ion-enhanced summoning. That's true. And on top of that, we'll be able to use more powerful techniques like Sabbaths. The pluses do seem to outweigh the minuses here. Guess I'll just have to get used to it. Looks like you're stuck with me till the end. I've gotta ask though, why'd that guy call you a traitor earlier? I was on a mission for Yadagarasu, and I wound up going undercover within the Phantom Society. They had no idea I was a double agent. But I had to protect Melody. So just like that, my cover was blown. The Phantom Society. That summoner we just beat was one of theirs? Yeah, and they're Yadagarasu's sworn enemy. The Phantom Society is a secret organization of devil summoners. Just like Yadagarasu. Where we differ, however, is our intentions. They want one thing. To see this world destroyed. You mean... Exactly. The end of the world you were talking about is almost definitely linked to the Phantom Society. Things are starting to come together here in a pretty big way. Safe to say, we can count Ion's appearance as part of all that. Sounds like we better hurry then. Enemy up ahead.
Into. No way to We're lacking in this one. <laughs> nice move. Okay. Take it away. That should work. Let him have it, Arrow. That should work. Silent as snowfall. So nervous. Too late for regrets now. Okay, I was just getting started. Yay! How's that? Yay! Great, right? Hey, Ringo. Be a bit of a waste to use demons solely for fighting, you know? Oh. You mean they can be used for other things? Yeah. Recon. You can send them out to scout our surroundings. And if we get into a fight, you can just call them right back. Oh. Then how about we give it a try? I don't recognize this one. This. Better play it safe. Remember, Here we might counterattack when we go. How's this? You know what to Let's do. Let's go with that. I hope this works. Reach you where you stand. There it is. Too late for regrets now. You wanted a fight? You got one.
pump systems all right. Here it goes. Wide open. What's our next? With this power, you. we can target silent as snowfall. Like I'd overlook that. Too late for the guts now. <laughs> Let's keep up with this Take power. Let God, him have it, go. arrow. Now, yeah, good plan. Can you handle this? Took him out. Wow, over already? Hmm. Awesome. Sight. With this Ooh, power, that'll let him have it, Arrow. It. Knew it. All right. Huh? Out of my way. How about this? You know what to do. Right. Take it away. That's freak you where you stand. Ouch. All according. Let's roll. Huh. Too slow. Too late for regrets now. Ah! Not as a letdown. Hey. Yeah. Have you found Melody yet? Wait, Arrow? But how? No time for small fry. Let's push on through. Right. You know the drill. With this power. Tell you. Let him have it, Arrow. On your orders. We can't find. I'll get serious. That might be dangerous, Shredder. Fredo. Good hit. Out of my way. Damn it! Eat this! <clears throat> I know we Let can win see. this. How's this gonna uh, go? How's that? We yeah. gotta win this. No matter what. No. Got her! Got so. Out of my way. I know we can win this. Let's go. That's a hit. We can't. All right. Gotta try. Go for Good it, Ringo. You little. Too late for regrets now. Damn it. <laughs> I know we can With win this. With this power. Careful. We don't Spring know how this will go. No way! You wanted a fight? You got one. Alright! How about that? Whoa. 
was crazy. Ah, uh, cool. So both Phantom and Yatagarasu are after this Melody person. But just who the heck is she? It's all you guys talk about. Melody is a devil summoner from the Phantom Society. However, they've marked her as a traitor. And what about you? You must have some reason to protect her, hmm? You gonna tell me? Well, I... Eh, it's fine. I'm sure I'll figure it out sooner or later. Let's keep moving. Ready whenever Fine. you need. It looks like I'll it'll work. Serious. That'll try. This ought to shred him. Night, I got this. We can silent as snowfall. Work. Too late for regrets now. We're nothing without switching to offense. Let Here goes. That. It's never just like training. Let's run for it. Now's our best chance. I knew it wouldn't be that easy. It's never. Let's retreat. Better not waste our energy. Guess that's how it goes. Melody! Looks like we need a change of plan. Yo, man! Yo, yo, Arrow's here. Except you ain't no ghost. Or us. Am I tripping, man? My boys told me you were straight up dead. They cut your mic. Stay off the stage, man. I don't know what I was expecting, but it wasn't this clown. Who's he? Yo, they call me Rob Soldier. Ought to be yes. It ain't hyperbole, cause I could kill on the beat, representing the Phantom Society. Okay.
That's it. That's the Covenant. No way. Whoa, whoa! Step off, homie. Phantom's gonna need all those Covenants. Only way we can rain some hell down on the whole world. We're going live! Your boy R.S., he's at the head of the pack. Proposers come at me and they don't come back. I drop that face like an earthquake. You throw hands with me, you made your last mistake. Let's go. <sighs> Here we go. Careful, Ringo. That swagger's not a front. He's tough. Call me all rest, cause I'm a dope MC. All my boys making noise in the COMP. So let's make this body count of one, two, three! We gotta win this. On. No matter what, remember. Uh huh. Scatter! Nice. Let me see. Make the call. Here. Lightning strike! Don't let I overlook that. Too late for regrets now. Ugh. We gotta win that try. This scatter! With this power, got, got it. it, Ringo. Too late for the next so one. Boost the tempo! Check it! We let's roll. We're lacking scatter. intel on this one. Out. Nice. Okay. Here yeah. goes. Out of my way. So what? Slick skill for a quick kill. Time to get ill. I'm rest in the house. Yeah. You're in bat, and that should do the trick. Can you handle this? I know we can win this. I got this. I hope this works. Glad you've got my back. Hang in there, Ringo. I owe you. Got the skills for the kills, cause they're genuine. Get what you get when you stop the landmine. Yeah, I'm the payoff and you're the punchline. Get ready. <laughs> This is not here for it now. Give that a try. Yeah. It's in switching to offense. Not yet. I got this. Too late for regrets now. Piss off! <laughs> We're still here we in go. the match. Shred him! <laughs> Nice to switching to offense. You mind? Hang in there, Ringo. I owe you. Out of my way. Keep that rhythm. Check it. Man, you're strong. Ugh. Defense mode active. <laughs> I'll wait it out. Slick skill for a quick kill. Time to get ill. I'm rest in the house. We yeah. got a looks like it. Shred him. Good hit. I can't die here. <laughs> Not out yet. I got this. Too late for regrets now. Shit. We gotta win this. Here we go. It looks like it'll. You got me. Kidding? I'm spitting gold bars. Your talk is cheaper. I'm the RS. And I don't fear no Reaper. I'm no Reaper, but I can send you to hell. So face the music, RS, and take the L.
Damn it! He had backup! Ringo! Fig! Ringo, what is this thing? <sighs> it's going into me? The Covenant's... joining with you. Covenant? Then... this was the point of Dr. Onda's message. Fig? Fig? Are you alright? Fig? I'm not detecting any abnormalities at the moment. My chest feels a bit hot, though. Feels strange. Huh. <sighs> so... you're a friend, then? That's right. I'm Fig. I'm an agent of Ion, just like Ringo. Pleased to meet you, Arrow. Pleased to meet you, Fig. Are there a lot of your kind out there? There are only two like us. Ringo and I have the unique ability to directly intervene with human affairs. Just to confirm, Fig. Are we too late to save Melody through normal means? Yes. By the time I arrived, she was already... Yeesh. Two soul hacks this quick, huh? Who'd have thought? Ringo? You can't mean... Are you going to bring Melody back? Like you did with me? Think about it this way. We know Arrow's death is somehow related to the end of the world. Arrow was trying to protect Melody. But what if we assume the trigger is not Arrow's death, but his failure to complete his mission? I can't authorize this. We don't even know if there were any consequences from the last soul hack. It'll be fine. I think I've got the hang of it. That's not the issue here. This is just to be safe. We need to be thorough, and that means cutting this thing off at every turn. And not only that, but I agreed to help Arrow protect Melody. So that's what I'm gonna do. Understood. I'll keep watch. Can I ask you to do the same, Arrow? <sighs> right. Protection set to partial. Spell sequence, soul hack. Systems are go. Process complete. This is an unjust world, a false world. Let's destroy it together.
Ah, such beauty. And so mournful, too. Just like him. Sure, you're the main squeeze of the man in the mask, but you're endable, expendable, so hope you brought a casket. Ooh, zip, talk about a fall. RS has got you with your back against the wall. Not until I know the truth. <sighs> A lot easier the second time around. And you are? Relax, lady. You don't have to glare like that. My name's Ringo. I'm an agent of Ion. I'm a super intelligent being born from the Sea of Information, and I'm here to stop the apocalypse. And what does this super intelligent being want with a dead woman? Well, Melody, how about I show you? Just come with me, and we'll go back. I'm dead, you simpleton. There's no going back. Why are you even here, anyway? I'm gonna save the world. That's more than the world deserves. Okay, guess it's gonna take a little more than that. So that's it? This is where you die, and you're okay with that? Because it sounded to me like you had something you still needed to do. You were running away. You wanted to survive. So take my hand, Melody. And you can survive. You'll get one more chance to make things right. She's back! I guess it's true. Ion really is something else. So, Ion is a non-human being born from a bunch of information, and you're like a splinter of it. 
That much I get. That also explains how I'm back from the dead. What I don't understand is why you're here. Wait, Melody! We're not with Phantom. We're here to protect you. Hmm? What are you talking about? Right, so, uh... I'm actually with Yadagarasu. My being with Phantom was all an act. These two here are helping me with my mission. Yatagarasu? Then you're still my enemy. Only if you're still a summoner for Phantom. They're after you too, aren't they? Doesn't seem like either of us is in the best spot. <sighs> <sighs> Could you even go back to the Phantom Society at this point, Melody? I think it'd be kind of hard. <sighs> What's your point? I'm saying we can help you. And it's not like we're asking you to spill your soul, so why not hear what we have to say? If your only concern is what you'll get out of it, that's fine. Even if you decide to act alone, a little more info couldn't hurt, right? <sighs> I suppose I'll take you up on your offer. For now. Then, it looks like Melody's safe and sound. Sure took a lot of effort, though. Now then, we'll want to go over everything we've learned so far. That should help us get a better understanding of the situation. There's still way too much we don't know. Like about covenants and how you two factor into all of this. For now, we should get out of here. This place is dangerous. But where should we go? If you need a place, I've got a safe house I've been using. We should be free to talk there. <sighs> Thank you, Arrow. Let's hurry then. <laughs>